Sarah Zool, Health Solutions Manager at Capnick Insurance Group. Today we're going to talk about summer fitness. Whether you are just coming up a trail or go to a school playground, we're going to talk about ways that you can take your exercise routine outside. The first thing I'm going to talk to you about is walking. Most of us can take a leisurely stroll, but one thing that to take your walking up a level is to try walking poles. Not only can it increase your calorie burn by 25%, it really helps you keep proper form as well. Now you can find these just about anywhere, Target, sporting goods stores, just about any place. And the price point starts at about $25. You can even have them custom made, which is of course gonna cost you a little bit more. Another way to keep track of your walking and to increase your mileage is to purchase a pedometer. And again, these can start at about $7, ranging up to all, almost $75. And again, you can find them just about anywhere. One thing you definitely want to try to take advantage of is to enjoy the water in the summertime. You can incorporate fitness various ways. You can swim laps if you have a pool or even a lake. You can also do build up some resistance and some strength training by incorporating treading water. Do this by alternating by just treading water with just using your arms. Take a break, then do some treading water just using your legs. That way you can really focus on upper body strength and then lower body strength. You can also use the water as resistance by doing some various strength training moves. Whether you do squats or lunges underwater, you can help use that resistance and it'll take less strain off of your joints. Another idea to incorporate summer fitness is to get your kids involved, whether it's your own kids, grandkids, neighborhood kids, nieces or nephews. Having their energy around you can help you be more active as well. Whether you just use a simple ball and play catch, chasing it around and bouncing it, or a hula hoop. Now, some of us might not be so good at it, but even just trying to master it, you can burn a lot of calories. Lastly, a jump rope is a great way as well. Getting the kids involved, having them jump rope, counting how many times they can do it consecutively, and kind of challenging each other back to back can be a great way to get everyone involved. Lastly, a great way to get some exercise is to go on a bike ride. You can get the whole family involved by going just for a simple bike ride around the neighborhood. You can own your own bike, rent one, or even borrow one from a friend. Regardless, it's important to just get out there and be active. Happy trails!